potentially regretting telling the OC to stay out of his business tonight. Because when you've got the enforcer of the bloodline and the wise man lurking, it's always best to have backup. Jimmy Uso receiving maybe some confidence from Paul Heyman that he will be welcomed back within the bloodline if he gets a win tonight. But do you believe Paul Heyman? I haven't believed Paul Heyman for 25 years. Why should I start now? But I get your point. I mean, Paul Heyman is out here to try to motivate Jimmy Uso, try to impress on Uso for the importance of taking out AJ Styles. So remember, put his hands on Heyman earlier tonight. Ooh! Jimmy Uso backing it up. That could do it. Cover for Jimmy Uso and the victory in AJ out of two. Listen to the impact of this. Ring shaking impact as Jimmy Uso backs it up. Somehow AJ Styles remains in this fight. I'd love to know what is going through the mind of Solo Sokoa right now. The enforcer, but also the younger brother of Jimmy Uso. But we've seen in the past where Solo's loyalty ultimately lies. That being with the Tribal Chief. That is undeniable. That loyalty is certainly never wavered. Well, there have been moments when it's been questioned. And Solo Sokoa has always come back to the flock. AJ opened the rally here. Quickly taken off his feet. This is SmackDown, says AJ Styles. The house that AJ built, hoping to put the bloodline away for the locker room. It's not just the OC anymore. And Jimmy glancing back at his brother. He continues to punish Styles in front of Solo and Heyman. Again, Roman Reigns, the undisputed champion for over 1,100 days, must be looking on. Moments ago, Jimmy utilizing his veteran instinct, ripping Styles down to maintain control of this one. And again, if you... We talked about this earlier. If you're Roman Reigns, you sort of understand why you're forcing Jimmy Uso to jump through hoops to possibly get back in the group. It's a trust issue. Roman Reigns can't trust this man. He kicked him in the face a number of times. Said a lot of derogatory things about Roman Reigns. Oh, God. Nasty landing for Uso. High angle, belly to back suplex. And if you guys remember correctly, it was Jimmy Uso who was the first one to tear away from Roman Reigns, even well before Jey Uso ever did. But Roman Reigns may not be the undisputed champion right oh. if it wasn't for Jimmy Uso at SummerSlam. All valid points, and the unfortunate truth is only one man knows for sure, and that being the Tribal Chief himself. Two proud Ooh. men just duking it out here. Oh! Caught him on the shoulder. AJ now responds emphatically. Styles with the Pele kick. Both athletes down. The stoic enforcer. The street champ Solo Sako watching on as we see this once more. Boom. You can see Jimmy almost habitually throwing up the one as he so often did, reverting back to the We The Ones t-shirts tonight. Jimmy Uso looking to recapture past glory, but Styles looking for vengeance. He was sad in the oh. Jimmy is set outside the ring right to the feet of his brother. Styles now lining it up. AJ! Oh! Forearm to the outside, rocks Jimmy Uso. AJ and Solo, of course, the issues from last week. AJ knows to tread carefully after having experienced the physicality of Solo. Just seven nights ago. AJ lining it up yet again. Here it comes. Phenomenal forearm. Scouted well by Jimmy. AJ has Jimmy Uso where he wants him. Knee right to the back of the neck. That could be it. Cover for AJ Styles to get the victory now. And Jimmy kicking out. The frustration starting to show for the phenomenal one. AJ no stranger to the deep waters. Styles, a former world champion, has held gold all around the globe throughout WWE. AJ's in his wheelhouse right now. Has fired up earlier on as we've seen AJ Styles in some time. Disgusted, but the OC weren't by his side when he was attacked by Jimmy. 
Oh! Uso out the back door. Jimmy Uso now in for the cover hook in that leg, and AJ out in time. And Jimmy may be getting frustrated here. Trying to figure out what he needs to do to put AJ Styles away. Again, you can't get much closer to a must-win than this matchup tonight for Jimmy. I exactly. agree with you. And the longer this match goes on, the more I would have to imagine it favors AJ Styles, simply because Styles is used to competing on an individual level. Jimmy Uso may not have the stamina that AJ Styles has. Well, one of the reasons he doesn't want to go to loan anymore, right? Oh! Headbutt. Given all he has now, the headbutt from Jimmy. Well, here goes AJ once more. It escaped by oh, oh, oh. So DDT. Good night. AJ starts to put away Jimmy, who's out of two. How close was AJ Styles? Certainly close, but we know almost only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. Oh. DDT right on the top of Jimmy's skull. But Uso able to survive. Styles said, This is it. Fire in the eyes of AJ Styles, a little distracted by Paul Heyman there. Now, Solo as well. I mean, but AJ's concerned about Solo taking a step closer to him. But notice how the wise man simply placed his oh! hand in front of the enforcer, and Solo stood still. Yeah, just that silent, that that, that silent distraction cost Styles. Notice all the offense now from Jimmy is being focused over to the bloodline side. So Solo and Heyman can get a first-hand look at what Jimmy Uso is doing to AJ Styles. And they say old habits die hard. And you can see Jimmy trying to make eye contact with Solo. And Solo not moving a muscle. And I think it's safe to say that it's the wise man pulling the strings right now. And his solo turned his back, and his brother AJ Styles made them both pay. AJ oh, goodness. Rolling here. Can he finish off Jimmy Uso? Jimmy was shocked that Solo didn't get involved when AJ was at his feet. Styles now. Phenomenal forearm. Quickly in for the cover to put away Jimmy Uso. And if you're Jimmy Uso, all you can say is, oh, no. Here's your winner, the Phenomenal.